Hey everyone, it's Ashley from Plan Here, and today we are going to talk about one of our most exciting new features, and that is adding Reels placeholders. So although Instagram doesn't support showing Reels um, yet on your grid, um, you can now add in a placeholder where you have that Reel on your Instagram grid so that you can really visualize your grid when you're planning it out with your posts and your Reels all in one on your plan workspace. So let's get started learning how to use it. So let's say you have posted a reel um, and it's in between these two images, right? So I would have this five things to focus on, a reel, and then this Christmas image. So what I'm going to do is click on these three dots and say missing reels. I'm going to add a placeholder. You can either upload the video or the cover photo that you're wanting to um, add in as a placeholder, just so you can kind of visualize that. Or, you know, if you've created it in Canva, you can go ahead and download that. I'm just going to upload some free content um, just to show you kind of what it will look like. So let's say my cover photo looked like this, and I'm wanting to add it in so that I can really visualize my grid. So I'm going to go ahead and upload that there, and it will show me that I have posted this reel. You'll see the little reels icon in the bottom left corner um, in between those two images where I selected it. So essentially... The main thing to remember is that you're going to click on the post right before the reel that you have posted on your Instagram grid. So if I post it in between these two photos, I would click on the one that I posted right before it. Three dots, missing reels, and then you'll add in your placeholder there. So then you'll be able to really visualize your grid better and be able to plan around those reels or, you know, see what you've posted um, where on your grid so that you can really visually plan your grid better. So I hope this helps and happy planning.